What's up, nerdlings? What up, nerdlings? Do you nerd for mail and mail, even in the little boxes? Sometimes it's even better. Mail and mail, mail and mail, mail and mail, mail and mail. Whoa. I think I'm glitching out. No! It's just the package we got from 8 Big Glitch. <laughs> so this was a little bit of a surprise. Sean, 8-Bit Glitch, sent us a message telling us that he had sent something our way, but we have no idea what. And then when it shows up in this small box, do you wonder what could be in there? I know, like Christmas time when it's the tiny packages under the tree, I'm always like, oh, what could that be? What could that be? <laughs> well, nerdlings, first and foremost, please be sure to check out 8-Bit Glitch. He has an amazing channel. Always love watching his VGM unboxings. He gets some great stuff. Love his commentary on those and his pickups. <laughs> Although, when he's out there picking up with Nintendo, a little bit of a bromance going on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, I have cut the sides just for you. Let's get into it. <laughs> right on top, we got a note. A note. Sorry, Nintendo, but he's passing us notes now. <laughs> Check this out. He's got There's his a own letterhead. letterhead. Wow. This guy's a pro. Oh my goodness. Hey Tom, hey Lacey. Do you nerd for trading cards? I was surfing eBay late one night, as most of us end up doing from time <laughs> to time, and I came across a complete set of the Conan trading cards Whoa. from 2004 that I've always wanted. Well, the seller had a deal that your second purchase would be 30% off. So I went looking, and when I saw this, I immediately thought of you guys, and I know if you like it, you nerd it. Enjoy. It should be the complete set. I had to fight the wife off from stealing these for herself. Have a fantastic day. Your devoted nerdling, Sean, 8-Bit Glitch. And he's glitching out. Oh my. So. Well, that alone, just the whole Conan thing is pretty cool. So, so that now I'm curious, are they Conan cards or did he see something else? So what have we got? Ghost poop. Oh, it's raining ghost poop! <laughs> oh my gosh! That is crazy! They're not Conan cards! Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, but it's even better! But they're just as legendary! Oh! Legendary Journeys! Hercules! Oh, wow! <laughs> okay. Oh, that is Right. I remember these when they first came out in the stores because that was back in the day when I was still into a bunch of trading cards and stuff. Loved my X-Men and my Marvel cards. And when they had Hercules cards, oh, man. anytime I actually had some spare money, I was picking them up. I don't know if I still have them, in you, all honesty. You were even trying to think if you could find them before we went to go meet Kevin Sorbo. Yeah. And we couldn't find them. So either they're packed away or they're gone. This is amazing. Well, I can see from that cover alone, or that first card alone, why the missus didn't want to send them off. Hmm, who wants to send off <laughs> Kevin Sorbo? Holy cow. That's this, a lot. I, I guarantee you I did not have anywhere near a complete set when I was picking them up because holy cow, that is a lot We're of We're going to have to get a bunch of card sleeves oh, so that we can display man. these. Wow. After a quick thumb through of the cards, we picked out a couple of ones that we liked. Uh, maybe our favorites. Maybe they're very nostalgic for one reason or another. Just some fun ones. I wanted to start off by saying this one. I mean, there's a not, not a lot going on here, but the fact that it was when he went to Atlantis back in the day. Mm -hmm. I love the whole lore of Atlantis, so the fact that they worked that into Hercules, right up my alley. I uh, have the one that I'm sure is why someone didn't want to let these go. Who doesn't want to see a little uh, shirtless Herc? Oh yeah, if, uh, if Mrs. Glitch saw that one, yeah, these cards would not be in our hands right now. <laughs> oh, and I tell you what, I actually have the perfect card for you to go with that one. Oh, do you? Which one? Oh, well, he does get hot. So, and he is hot. <laughs> and I can attest that even now, he's still hot. He, 
<laughs> he still looks pretty damn good. <laughs> I won't lie. I think we each found a card of Autolycus. <laughs> now I've got the beanstalks and bad eggs. Now, Hercules always had some tongue in cheek humor anyway, but I do remember in this one, they had the cheesy line of harpies. Harpies, can't get rid of them. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got just flat out the king of thieves. Well, let me tell you, growing up, I was a huge fan of Bruce Campbell from Briscoe County Jr., as well as the Evil Dead and Army of Darkness And see, films. this is where I was introduced to Mr. Bruce Campbell, because this is the only thing I've ever seen him from. And then when I met a couple of friends of mine, they introduced me to him as Ash. And then meeting you, you introduced me to him as Briscoe County Jr. So. Well, see, once he showed up in Hercules and Zeta, he was it perfect. was like, oh my gosh, I love this guy. <laughs> I've got Miss uh, Warrior Princess before she had her own show, and it's oh. like, uh, what are her and Eolus getting ready to do? Uh, we know what they're going to do. <laughs> hey, I tell you what, I've got a matching one because I've got the Warrior Princess. Now, this is from the alternate world where they're uh. all evil, but she looks so cool with that haircut. Kind of uh, giving off a Chicago vibe. A little bit. I always wonder, why in TV shows, if you put a beard on, you're evil? Like, in the Mirror Universe and Star Trek, Spock with the beard was evil. Hercules with the beard, she's, evil. She's not lying, guys. I mean, look at this. Armageddon now, too? Yeah, he's got the beard because he's evil. <laughs> well, I have one special for you. Oh, ooh, well, that would be Miss Alexandra Tidings as Aphrodite. And there's nothing wrong with knowing her real name to follow her other works. And her uh, rather revealing dress. Oh, <laughs> she was the best Aphrodite, let me tell you. <laughs> this one is just the perfect picture of my favorite duo. Nice, yeah, so, that is a great picture of It's them. just a perfect picture of them. This honestly would be one that I would take if we were going to a convention with both of them and have them sign oh, it. Oh, that would be great. Well, speaking of Eolus, I just got a good picture of him with his sword out because he was a little hot-headed at times. A little bit, a little bit. I do love Kevin Sorbo's Hercules, but Eolus was always my favorite. Mm, that's true, so, same here, same boat. And uh, speaking of Hercules and his bride, Aww. this is the episode that they actually met and uh, started, you know, getting to know each other a little bit. This was the very first episode she was on. You know what would be really cool? is if you could sit down and watch that episode with Kevin Sorbo. You mean like we did? <laughs> <laughs> Timing's gotta be right. So I have, I have the arrow with the knife in my hand like that. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. And they, they whip pan and you go, wow. and you're right there. And it works, it works. And later episodes when she came back as the Golden Hind. Yeah, we do monsters. Wait, it's not slimy though, is it? No. It's not slimy, it's it's kind of a doe, a deer, a female deer. There she is in all of her golden glory. Oh, I bet she keeps you warm at night with all that deer fur. Oh. But she's nice to snuggle up to in the winter. <laughs> all that soft deer fur. <laughs> well, I don't know if I can top how good looking she is, but I will try with oh, men in pink. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Michael Hurst in drag. <laughs> 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 oh my gosh. Sean, thank you. This is so awesome. This much. is a great surprise. Oh, what an incredible surprise. <laughs> hey, of course, we, we absolutely love Hercules. So we do. this is so cool. Thank you. Thank you so much. We've actually been going back through the, the episodes ever since yes. we got back from the convention in March. And uh, we've been having a blast going down memory lane and being like, I totally remember this episode. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe more importantly, thank you, Mrs. Glitch, for yes. <laughs> letting the cards come into our home. They're in a good, they're in a good home. Trust oh, me. well, yeah. Trust me, she's not going to be letting these leave her side anytime soon. Nope, we got to go to the store and get some of those card sleeves <laughs> so we can put them in there. <laughs> well, one last time, thank you so much, Sean. Yes, thank Nerdlings, you. Please 
hit up 8-Bit Glitch's channel. Links will be in the description below. Leave some comments down below what you think of Hercules, this card set. Did you guys collect any of the cards, these cards, or just Hercules Legendary Journeys memories that you happen to have? <laughs> and be sure to go tell Sean on our behalf. Thank you again so yes, much. Yes, thank you. I know what your favorite Hercules memory is. Anything to do with Aphrodite. Oh, I was going to say your Spartan clasp. Oh, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Hey, future Tom, we could never get enough of that. Won't you uh, pop that in <laughs> right here? That is me and Kevin Sorbo doing the Hercules handshake. <laughs> All right, well, guys, if you happen to like the video, please give it a like. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go over to Tee Public because we've got merchandise over there. Hit us up on the Retro Refresh. And if we like it, we nerd it. For the duo that is Hercules and Iotis. And her duo, apparently. <laughs> Bye, nerdlings. Bye, nerdlings. You didn't cut all the sides. Yeah, <laughs> we just watched that episode. Oh, well, okay. Uh, that one. This might be a little tough to narrow down. Although, I did set one aside just for you. Is that his wife, his real life wife? Yes. Is that? Okay. There's actually the episode they met. And if we like it, we nerd. Wow. I was going to say, we nerd for it. What part? The whole thing? Yeah. Okay. And as always... <laughs> Thanks. I was like, what do I say?